Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make videos on Canva. First, I'm going to select a template for an example. And I may share this on YouTube, so don't forget to watch it. So, we'll go over here and type video. So, we're just going to enter. And we're going to find a lot of these over here. But if you don't like one of these, so like today, we're going to start creating it with a blank slide. So we can add our own covers. So over here, I'm going to add a cover for our video to start. Let's find a cover real quick and let's think of a topic. So let's make a story on a girl who was very mean to her sister. It's just an example. So let's start with choosing the first slide, which would be the cover. Hmm. We're going to use the previous um, magic elements of Canva to edit photos and we're going to use them in our video today. So, let's see. I think we can start with this one, which is actually pro. So, please don't try it without asking your parents if you're a child, not an adult. Okay. So, so let's write the heading first. Okay. First, I think we should like erase this part, delete this all because we do not want to edit each, you know, each word. It would be very difficult. We'll just delete all of them real quick. Yeah, we're done. Now we're going to go to the text I, uh, text section and we're going to choose some a type of text which we would prefer in this. I think that this would look very good. And it's kind of confusing. So if you want to make it a bit clear, let's just choose this one. I think so. This is better. So we're just going to type down the heading. So we're going to write the... the mean sister this is an exemplar video a story video which we're gonna create today so first let's put it in place like over here then we're gonna we can just you know organize these images where we want we can just set them yeah i think this is better and we can add up some more things from the elements hmm. nature it's gonna look good with this so we're gonna go to the graphics section and choose out some cute things it's like this move the caterpillars kind of like this just gonna put this one a bit down yeah I think this is good now we're gonna add some more things this actually doesn't suit like the topic of the story but this does look good so our main so our main you know what the main thing we want is our slides to look good so that more people can see them and people would like them more often so yeah just take uh, let's just add some more things and then we're gonna be done because we don't want to make the example video too good it's gonna take a lot of time videos actually are very hard as you see on my channel i've made some of them they're very hard to make not that hard but kind of hard again again children please do not use the pro images if you don't have the premium premium part first ask your parents don't 
accidentally pay, you're gonna get in big trouble. Because you never know when it pays automatically for pressing some premium images. For this part, let's see. Yeah, for this part, if you w just want to see the free ones, not the pro ones, you can just click over here on this icon and then you can come to this part which is written free. Just cl click on it and click back and you can get, and then it will show you only the images which are free to use. So, this is also a nice thing in Canva so you don't get confused and actually click on the premium part. Let's just remove this one. For removing it, you can just click on this icon, clear all okay i think we're done with this page for now we just uh, for setting the timing you can just do this we just need this much people don't need to see it for so long okay now we're gonna add the background so we're gonna go to the photos icon because in the background you can only see glittery sparkly some type of you know decoration background now we're gonna search living room let's see yeah, this one's good i think so just gonna zoom it it doesn't fit so we're gonna use one of the techniques magic expand so we're gonna hold page yeah so it's just gonna take a few seconds as you see over here till the time i wanted to tell you that please check all my canva videos which i created they're gonna help you a lot and the ones which are created in canva like fake friend part one and part two uh, uh problems with a little sister was like that or something and you know so over here it's expanded our living room let's see which one we prefer more this looks weird this looks weird <laughs> look at this window this looks weird too. This is the most um, relevant one, I think. Because these all oh, the window was looking so, you know, <laughs> weird. It was looking like somebody broke it into pieces. Over here, it's looking kind of bloody, but it's okay. Who's gonna see the window like that? But that was getting too highlighted. So, yeah, back to what we were doing. Now, we're gonna go to elements and search a girl. So we're gonna get some options. So we're gonna choose the girl and use it all over the video. Uh, the big sister is gonna be mean and the small sister is gonna be good. She looks more like a mother. So we're gonna use her as the mom. She's kind of tall. This is much better. Yeah, she's gonna be the mom. She looks like the big sister. We're gonna use her. So just make her a bit bigger. She's gonna be almost the height of her mom. And let's choose a small sister. This one, she looks so cute. She's gonna be the smaller one. This small family looks so good. Now, th as this is a story video, we're gonna uh, make them actually do things, but not in the way that they couldn't do it in one video, uh, one, uh, template so we're gonna use several templates to make them uh, kind of like show their emotions using emojis because you can't change you can actually change their faces now, this feature would be very useful if canva updates it but for uh, for now we can just use emojis emojis are best things to use because i love them okay yeah we've chosen the characters now we're gonna start with the video we're gonna do the emojis afterwards so we're gonna keep this template open now we're gonna go to the text and we're gonna write first we would need um like we're gonna write the story first so we're just gonna put it over here so first we're gonna write so once upon a time come up Comma, there lived a sweet little family. 
family family yeah. there were two sisters one was like uh, she could be 13 actually 14 one was actually she looks like a 14 year old yeah one was 14 years old and one was she looks like um six year old one was six and yeah So one day the big sister started acting me with the small one. So like we've done this one. So we're just gonna drag it to that corner just try some white area or there so we don't want it to like merge in with the objects at the back yeah this is better so now everybody can see this clearly so the main objective of writing text and placing it like in some places we actually want to make it visible to others so for example if i move this text over here it's gonna be a bit jumbled up and you can see it mm -hmm. if i move it over here it's gonna be a bit jumbled up with the window black part of the window it's gonna look like not that easy to read but if i put it over here in plain white space then it's not gonna look jumbled up it would look clean and clear and everybody can read it and second of all you you have you can't just choose any color you want for the text you have to choose only the color which does not merge in with the background like for example the background slide and i choose like this color it's gonna be very difficult to read or if the backgrounds like if the backgrounds for example green color or something and wait well if the backgrounds uh, like red color or something light red and you use orange on it and you use colorful things on some background which can merge in with them and it's, it's not going to be easy to read then that wouldn't work every nobody would like your design so yeah that's the main concept of keeping your text clear okay yeah yeah so we're gonna move on to the next slide so like we've done this we don't need to do it all over again you can just uh, click on this you see these three dots over here just click on them and uh, you have some options over here click on duplicate page so it's gonna give you the same page see this one and this one they're totally similar so for this one we're just gonna remove the text and we're gonna remove this mother because we just want them having a conflict so the child can the tiny sister can be here and the bigger one can be there so we're gonna take some text boxes so we're gonna take text box yeah let's find out a good one we can use this yeah I normally use this one so or we can give a slight change we can put this one because it looks good we're gonna put it besides the person who's saying like on the top or maybe beside i think top would be better yeah i'm just gonna write down so in this you can't write in it basically so first we're just gonna wait so we're just gonna uh like put the adjust them where we want them to be and then we can go to the text icon and choose a text type uh, i'm just gonna go with a simple one because it's much easier to understand and you don't need, need to make it short or big so we're just gonna write what the bigger one says actually we're gonna start with the smaller one so let's think of something that she's gonna say hmm. wait first let's i think the smaller one can be like 
sissy can you please play the party the party with me so I just gonna adjust it inside the box so we can just go to the elements and make a table which uh, which has some you know like tea party things organized on it tea party big table let's see i hope we find one hmm it does not look something which matches but we need to then make it up first we're gonna choose a pink table pink table we can use um graphics this one looks good we can use this and minimize the size we can take some tiny pink chairs which one would look good hmm a chair this one for children actually because nobody would want to buy like sofas for them because first we're just gonna put these as they're kind of small just gonna expand the kind of size uh, oh wait just this one does not have an like one which is opposite to it so we can we can't basically use it oh we we can use tools but because it's not gonna be like you have to turn it like i mean you have to turn it because you can't even see that back part which supports your back because that only tells you if you have to turn it or not so we're just gonna copy paste it so this comes at the at the top of them to uh, to look like the chairs are not on the top of the table's mat but the table's mat is on top of the chairs yeah we need to add some more details so our video does not look weird so now we're gonna put some tea party stuff pink tea set so let's see which one looks better hmm let's use this one here and we're gonna copy paste one more over here so why am i copy pasting and not just taking it from here because when you copy paste you don't need to adjust the size actually sometimes it adjusts on its own and sometimes you need to adjust it again so it's much easier to copy paste we're gonna use this teapot because it looks very cute we're gonna place it over here just gonna copy paste these so it gets on the top of the teapot i mean in front of it otherwise it would look like the teapot in front of them which does not suit that much so i move ahead yeah now like you see the teapots merging into the background so once you click on it some of most of the images get this option over here in which you can change the colors so the color there are three colors in this one and you can carefully see which color is where so it's some of them we don't get so please don't open things and accidentally click on something which can end you in trouble or end giving money to them because you don't want that without asking your parents so yeah so let's change the color of this light pink one because it's the color of the teapot we're gonna make it into darker one this one see now it's more clearly visible this one can be the same color wait no 
a bit lighter no 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 yeah this is good now it's better see now you can clearly see it first it was like literally merging in with the background so that's what i was saying now this big sister is gonna be mean to her no can't you see i'm busy She's gonna say this, so we're just gonna add it over here. We can just decrease the size. We can put it inside the box. This is much better. And now she, where should we put her? She would be like literally relaxing on the couch with her laptop in her hand. And there would be black pink, black pink or some type of music going on, and her sister would be like, "But you're just listening to music," and then she's gonna be even meaner. So we're gonna go to the elements, search for laptop. Now we're gonna go. This one looks good. So like you see this laptop now it doesn't show that changing the color image uh, I mean the place where you can change the color so that means you can't change the color in this one now let's put some headphones on her head headphones hmm which one would look good. Which one? Which one? Which one? Which one? Hmm. I can really find some. We'll just use these ones because if you can't find them, you just need to do something. No need. Yeah, this is much better. So she's just listening to music. Wait, can we change the color to the card? Sadly. So now in the next slide, out. Now in the next slide, we're gonna show that that the sister is like literally looking at her, and then that one is actually listening to music, and she can hear a bit of it. So let's go duplicate page. Now we're just gonna delete this. Delete this. We're gonna use this part, and we're gonna use confused emoji. Because the sister is going to be confused. Oh, I got the spelling wrong. I think so. She's, she'd be like, huh? What the hell? She's literally listening to music. I'm just gonna go for some lines. Okay. How you like that? Da, 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 da. Like that, da, 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 da. Like going on, I'm just gonna put some music sign. Music sign. Let's see which one would suit. Yeah, this one was the perfect one. I'm just gonna expand the size kind of. 
I'm gonna use this on my head. Can I use this side to put it over here? I'm gonna even I'm gonna make it even smaller. And smaller I need to copy paste. Last one. So it's like she's listening to music, and you can see the music song. Yeah. Yeah. Now she's gonna go peek into her laptop, and then she's gonna see that there's black pink music going on. Like there's a photo of black paint, so I'm gonna add in duplicate page, and then we're gonna go back and choose one like laptop close up. Let's see if we can find something. So we're gonna add it to another page. She's gonna li literally peek into her laptop, which is not actually good, but she's small, so yeah. But taking advantage of being small is not good, not good at all. She's gonna do this, we're gonna turn the background white, actually, gray because. Because it's you know the sofa. The laptops, this part should be black then. And this part can be white. Red. Now we're gonna see a black pink one. Like where is it? Hmm. The photos to say like um, Black pink. And yeah, you know, guys, this video has gone a lot long. So, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna make the next part and share it with you guys as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. I hope to see you in the next part too. Thank you.